Hey everybody, Damon and Sophie here to feature a 1983 Mercedes-Benz 300 CV. Is that backwards? Yes, there you C go. CV. <laughs> uh, amazing car, low miles. We're going to get right here to the cold start and uh, we're going to do a walk around and Sophie is going to do her traditional test drive. And what's funny about this today is Yesterday, she did a test drive video of a Whipple supercharged Shelby Mustang that had like 800 horsepower. And now she's going to do a turbo diesel Mercedes from 1983. And she is not going to uh, set any speed, speed records today. But she's going to drive in a very classic, cool, unique car. So you're going to have to get the camera like right in here. And I'm going to go down here and put my hand on the turbo, which is right there to show everyone. It's cold, it's been sitting here for two days. Um, yeah, engine's ice cold. Well, 90, 88. Let's see, what am I gonna talk about? Car is in amazing condition. Uh, we're gonna talk about the condition today. We're not gonna talk about all the details of these cars because you guys on Bring a Trailer know more about these cars than we do. We're here to talk about condition and for the bring a trailer auction and talk about uh, how neat the car is. So let's fire it up. Yeah. yeah. It's gonna sound so much different than that Mustang <laughs> yesterday. But I think you're gonna like this one. Oh, I do like Mercedes. You know me. It's heavy. Yes, classy. That's true, you do like Mercedes, you have one. <laughs> So this has what's called a glow plug. So when you put the key in the ignition, you're gonna turn it to the right. There's gonna be a little squiggly line on there to the right, a little more. See on the right hand side, the yellow? Mm -hmm. That's gonna go out. That means that the glow plug, no, the one that was right over here, uh, it was on, now it's off. Yep, so that means okay. it heats up the glow plugs because it's a diesel and that's gonna help it start. So I'm gonna go back to the exhaust and you can start it up. I bet it's gonna smoke because it's a turbo diesel. Uh, let's see, over here. Alrighty. Well, not much, a little bit. The, the fun thing about this is not only does it start right up and run great, look at the lines. There it is, 450 plus thousand miles of pure entertainment and joy that you can put on in this engine. These things are indestructible and they will run forever. So that means with a mere 42,000 miles on it, you got another, uh, 400 plus thousand miles you can put on this car, but wait till you see the condition. This car is stunning. 1983. I am gonna pick out a few of the flaws, but the car is absolutely unbelievable. Look at this. Unbelievable. A little different than the Shelby yesterday, huh? Fun. It's so very it's nice. This now this is original, 1983, wow. 41,000 miles. That's how, amazing. How do people do that? 1983. Oh 1983. This car's 40 years old, and it's in this condition. Okay, let's do our quick walk around. Uh, we're gonna pick this apart. We're gonna start at the front. Uh, always look at the headlights, the bezels. Uh, they're in really good condition. This rubber here has a little bit of, uh, the rubber just kind of, the coating on it over time, just, it still looks good from here, but if you get up close, it's a little rough. Uh, the headlights, the bezels, all of this, there's no cracks. Uh, very good condition. Bumpers in great condition. Wheels. 
Uh, the tires are a 21 date code. So uh, you can see it's just absolutely phenomenal. So I'm gonna go around this side. I don't see anything. The chrome is absolutely perfect. Chrome up on top is perfect. They all get a little bit of wear on some of this weather stripping. The top, amazing condition, just crazy. There's a couple little scratches right here by the, uh, the gas lid right here on the edge. Look at the inside of that. I mean, that's 40 years old. It's amazing. Yeah. I, I, I'm speechless. I don't know how cars stay in this condition. This hasn't been restored. Look at these lights. I've I've bought and sold a lot. It actually looks like this it has a little hairline crack right here. But I've seen these for years and you just don't see very many in this condition. I mean, the bumper's never been bumped into. How do you not back into something? It's crazy. And it's not restored. This is the way it was. There's a little bit of paint discoloration right there on the edge. The rubber is, uh, you know, it's not soft, soft, but it's not hard either. You can definitely tell it hasn't been out in the sun because, I mean, this is still pliable. Some dust up here. A couple little, looks like this could be polished out. Looks like something scratched the top up here a little bit. The sides in amazing condition. Tiny scratch in the chrome right there. Can't see it from two feet away. Uh, there is a couple things on the hood. Make notation, somebody touched up the paint here. Uh, there's a little mark here, here. I don't see anything on this side. Uh, there is some weather stripping cracks up here. Factory weather stripping. It's pretty hard, so I wouldn't want to push on it. I mean, it would, uh, you gotta be careful when you wash it with a wash mitt. These are not the factory wiper blades. At least they're not the same ones that are on the R107. So I, I don't know if these are factory. They don't look factory. I would imagine they're a uh, stainless steel look but yeah car's in amazing condition and sophie's gonna take look at this thing it's crazy i don't get it i i, I don't how do you not drive a car how do you keep it in this well, condition you have other cars to drive <laughs> there's a little bit of difference in the shading like this is just kind of faded a little bit yeah just a little bit it's not perfect, it's but a beautiful color. it is. Called, you know? Kind of a camel. Yeah. Dash isn't cracked. Air conditioning works great. All righty, go do your thing. Not gonna set any speed records. Not gonna get any tickets either. But you're gonna get a lot of looks because that's one really, really nice 1983 300 CD. This is the version with the bike rider in it. So that's kind of cool. Here she comes. Oh, bike's gonna turn right in front of her. And yeah, there he goes. And here she comes. Look at that. Wow.
ready to go back inside and get all covered up with all our friends. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I don't know what to say other than this car is amazing. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah, you can feel it. Yeah. I'm speechless. I'm speechless. Oh, that power. 800 plus horsepower. Maybe 80 horsepower. Wow. Do that again for the Mercedes fans. <laughs> Was that it? <laughs> Look at this. Where can you buy this car? Bring a trailer. Yes, ma'am. We love bringing trailers. And this is no reserve. No reserve? So you could win it for a dollar. It's yeah, possible. It's worth a little bit more than a dollar. It's possible. Maybe two dollars. <laughs> All right. Good luck, everyone. We will see you on the test drive video on this 1983. Sophie's excited. Mercedes Bye everyone.